a while since we've done a video, but we've been busy here on the farm. But we uh, were at the grocery store today, and on the clearance rack, we found some bananas. So we thought we would bring home some treats for the animals. They're too busy eating. They'll figure it out. Come on, guys. So these four out here right now, these are Cypress's babies. They're about three and a half, almost four weeks old now. They really love the bananas. The littler ones are Cheese's babies. They're about a week and a half old, so they haven't quite figured out the whole food besides mom bit yet. But once they do, I'm sure they'll love the bananas too. So the babies don't really like the peels as much as the adult ones do, but one person who really loves the banana peels is Bella. What are you doing, Paisley? Eating bananas. That's not yours. Not sure about that. <laughs> but there's dirt on it. You gave him a dirty banana? Yeah, pigs eat him. So spring comes, and once again, Chewy's been an issue. Breaking fences, destroying things, because that's what he does best. Um, so we've been busy. We've been putting in a new fence line here to try and change the paddocks here for winter so that we can repair this and build a new barn maybe next spring. Little Chucky here, who was born last fall, is getting big, as you can see. Um, still as shy as ever and won't let us get close. Uh, <laughs> Chuck, you need to get brushed. We just want to brush you. That's all we want to do. Oh, got your butt scratched. I touched him. <laughs> so if you guys remember last year we brought home this old playhouse that we bought in an auction and turned it into a chicken coop my dad's been busy over here working for about a week on and off depending on the weather but he's been building this addition for us for our new chicken coop so that we can run power and water out here and avoid dragging the buckets from the house in the winter so come in here here's our existing chicken coop We'll keep that with the chickens. And then the addition part, we'll have our little laundry sink with some water, electrical, and then we'll have brooding boxes for our hatched chickens and ducks so that we can get them out of the garage in the springtime. Well, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.